Hey guys, in the this side from 24 by 7 everything. Hope you all are doing great. We are again back with another video and this time it's on Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1. So in this particular video we will going to uh, like install and uninstall the Magix Canary version. So basically this particular version of Magix is needed by some of the custom room developers and you will surely be able to know in the coming days that why I have created this video and how it will be useful for you and as so so uh, for the installation process we have to uh, like switch to the chrome browser so i have already created a dedicated article on my official blog the url for the same will be provided to you in the description below so that you can go over afterward again nothing major has been mentioned here few links few prerequisite and few installation and uninstallation steps so again uh, for the installation and uninstallation there are two different links so firstly for installing the file you just have to tap it here and it, afterward it will uh, download a apk file in the background and it will be by default downloaded to your download folder apart to uninstall you, you just have to tap in here and afterward uh, again uh, whatever would be the latest version whenever you will be viewing this particular video just tap in on that particular assets folder and afterward you just have to select the magics uninstall again this is a two point something file just tap it here and download it nothing major and basically you don't have to select magics v20.4 uh, for installing magics because uh, in few uh, for few custom room it is only canary version and for few this is a simple so it will be but in this particular video we are focusing on canary version okay so finally you have uh, successfully downloaded everything now few prerequisite firstly backup your data for safer side then charge your phone's battery at least 50% or more but I will recommend to have at least 80% or more just for the safer side a part of this bootloader should be unlocked reference videos videos mentioned below TWRP custom recovery should be installed again reference videos videos mentioned below now we'll jump to the installation part so firstly install the magics manager using this particular downloaded file so as soon as you will be uh, like downloading this particular uh, installing the magics canary uh, sorry uh, magics manager afterward you have to download the magics canary version using this particular interface after successfully downloading you just have to move to twrp recovery mode and you just have to follow these three steps install or flash the downloaded file then wipe cache dalvik reboot the phone after that magics would be uh, successfully installed before that let me confirm you that my phone is not rooted for that i am just going to tap on root checker so it is already showing me but let me close it and I'll show you again so I'm just going to click on root checker now it is asking verify root let me click it here sorry root access is not properly installed sure so to cut down the time I have already downloaded those two files at my side so let me show you so this is the app release apk file so we just have to tap in here and after it will ask do you want to install this application yes we will be so it will hardly take a minute to install the uh, Magix Manager at your site. So just wait for that. So successfully we have installed the Magix Manager but Magix, is, Magix Canary version is still not installed. So we have to install it. So for that you just have to tap it here. And after it will uh, ask you allow then uh, you have to just select the uh, default option preserve AVP and so after method download zip file next and afterward you are good to go with the let's go. So download complete in the background it will start the uh, uh, like magic scenario versions zip file which we will be going to install in the TWRP recovery mode. So once the installation will uh, once the downloading process will be completed you can again move to your download folder to verify. So this is the zip file which we have already downloaded at our side and this is the uninstaller file and this was for the magic canary version magic manager so now we are good to go with the installation process using twrp recovery mode for the magic so i'm just going to tap on restart button and within next few seconds we will be booted into the twrp recovery mode so we have successfully booted into the twrp recovery mode so this is their by default interface here we just have to tap on install button afterward we have to select storage so in this video I'll be referencing to internal storage but it will always best that to download the file and keep it in your external storage like use USB OTG pen drive or micro SD just for the persons who don't have USB OTG at their side and micro SD card this video will surely help them. So as I have told you earlier that we have already downloaded two basic file or two the, or I would say needed file one is this particular magic sun installer and the above one is the magics file so we just have to select the add particular file and afterwards swipe to confirm flash now the actual routing process will start and it will take nearly about two to three minutes so let's wait till the time it completes 
so finally the installation process of magix has been successfully completed now we are left with two option one is wipe cache dalvik and reboot system i always prefer to go to wipe and cache dalvik as it will clear out all the uh, like uh, junk file behind this uh, installation process afterward we are good to go with the reboot system again i'll set, uh, tell you that if someone will uh, face any boot loops using this then i have already recommended you to download that uninstallation file as well so that if you will face anything although there is very less chance if you will be uh, uh, like proceeding with the steps as i mentioned if you will again face then you can just again move to the twrp recovery mode and uh, flash that particular uninstallation file and you will be out of these boot loops so let's wait till that time we uh, move into the login screen or home screen so finally we have been booted to the login screen let me just enter my password and now let me move to the magix manager and let me confirm you that magix installation is totally completed so now you are able to view that magix has been successfully installed and it is asking us to delete it and so on so now uh, we have successfully installed the magix now so now let me confirm you in the root checker as well so by default you are able to view that congrats congratulations root access is properly installed let me do once more time so again same thing congratulations root access is already properly installed on your phone so finally the installation process has already mm -hmm. completed now let's move to the uninstallation process for that you just have to again restart your phone and move to the uh, i would say uh, twrp recovery mode again uninstallation will be for the ones who will be facing issue after installing it but uh, or maybe they might make their mind that no bro i don't want uh, root i don't want to root my phone and so on so that's why i've created a single video in this particular case so that it will beneficial for both so within next three to four seconds we'll move to the twrp recovery mode so we are finally on the twrp recovery modes interface so these are install wipe and so on so again we have to tap on install afterward we have to select storage so if you are using uc uh, otg pen driver micro st you can utilize that or choose that i'm using internal storage for now so i'm just going to select okay and as earlier i have already told you that it would be go good to have uh, downloaded both the files so we had already downloaded so let me select on uninstaller so swipe to confirm flash so all the steps are already mentioned in that blog you can just move to and uh, see uh, each and every bit so finally the uh, magic sun installer has completed the installation process or uninstallation process now we are good to go with the reboot system but before that let me tap on wipe cache dalvik so that all the junk file created behind this particular uninstallation process will be removed and now we are good to go with the reboot system once this particular phone will be rebooted to the home screen or login screen then i'll again confirm you the status of uh, like uh, routing or i would say magic installation and so on so just wait for that so finally our phone has been successfully booted to the login screen let me enter my password and we'll move to the further on so as i've told you earlier that we have completed the uninstallation process so let me go to magix manager and now you will see that it will prompt us to install rather than showing us the installed version and so on and apart to this let me move to root checker again and let let you uh, confirm you the status of rooting as well so it has mentioned sorry root access is not properly installed on this device now apart to this if you really want to get rid of magix manager as well just tap it here and move to the uninstallation process and afterward you have successfully uninstalled the magix and also remove the magix manager as well and so on so hope you like this video if you really like this video kindly share this with your friends and family and apart from this please subscribe to our channel because this will surely motivate us and boost us to create more videos like this in the coming future finally it's the time to sign off now bye for now thanks